Summer has arrived, and Appalachian Wireless has a great sale on the world's hottest smartphone from now to the end of the month. You can get the amazing iPhone 13 for more than half off because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. A bridge being built as part of US 460 that will provide a shorter route between Pike County and Grundy, Virginia is en route to being the tallest bridge in Kentucky. Uh, this bridge is over Pond Creek at Draffin. It is 300 and when completed, it'll be 324 foot tall, which will be the tallest bridge in the state of Kentucky. Um, initially, uh, I mean, probably 15 years ago, we were going to uh, do a fill in, in Pond Creek and do a drainage tunnel to drain the creek. And But after a public meeting, uh, we decided to go back with the bridge. And uh, so the, the design proceeded. Uh, the project was let to construction two years ago and they should be finished um, sometime next year. So essentially this Pond Creek Bridge is a section of the overall uh, US 460 project. And we've been working in sections and completing in sections. And that's why there's areas where that you can drive on now and areas that uh, you can't drive because we're working in sections on those. Construction on the bridge began two years ago. The bridge is a thousand feet long and due to difficult terrain, engineers had to get creative with how to put the bridge together. This is a steel brick bridge. Uh, the, the spans are uh, 225 feet, uh, three of them in the center and the ones on the end are 175 feet. Uh, but the beams, uh, generally our beams for a project this size are 120 foot long and it would have been very difficult to get them to the site to lift uh, with the crane and conventional method. So uh, they worked with uh, Stantec Engineering to design a launching system for uh, this structure. The beams of the bridge were constructed on the road. 400 feet of the beams were constructed at one time and pushed across the valley without having to lift them. And it's kind of an unusual thing all around too, isn't it? Well, that, yes, this is not done very often. And, uh, <clears throat> and again, the only reason it was done here is because of the uh, the location. Since the beginning of construction, there have been no delays and progress on the bridge has been running smoothly. For more information about the bridge or to see updates, live footage, and time-lapse footage of the bridge's construction, visit us460online.com. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.